that's where I see serverless in 10 years. Everybody just doing writing application in serverless, and nobody even talks about like building up the EC2 whatever. But um, but I think after that, what could happen is that we already see from some company doing it is that the uh, even more componentized um, applications, such as like even Amazon doing this similar thing, which is um, people just people don't even write application logic. They actually just reuse the component that's already built with the infrastructure ready and just plug it in. So mm -hmm. you even you even even less business logic basically. Yeah, I, I actually agree. Um, so when I was first starting IO Pipe, um, the original premise before we realized the observability was um, a much better and effective and timely wedge. Um, we had experiment with some prototypes around building reusable components, mm -hmm. um, and the idea was that not just could we have reusable components, but when we get to a point of you know, a serverless world, when we don't have to worry about the infrastructure side and the code defines the requirements of infrastructure, right. and we have reusable components, at what point can we use machine learning to compose those components in a way where developers are no longer writing new code? Mm 